what's up guys i'm from bsc tech in today's quick and short video i will explain how you can uh, transfer data between android and ios devices without any hassle without paying for a paid app app is actually called share it which you can download from android play store and from ios store easy to find it just write share it and simply go ahead and download once open on android you will see this uh, interface quite annoying if you see this for the very first time you'll see this pop-up notification coming up every now and then it's a free version you're not paying for anything so expect that to have some sort of uh, uh, advertisements every now and then but it will work fine so you shouldn't have any problem with that on the ios side the interface is also very identical uh, only difference is uh, obviously apple's uh, operating system once you open both of them it will look like this very straightforward three uh, notification toggle uh, tabs on the top on android and iphone uh, send receive files send receive and files files are the ones which you already received is send and receive are different so if you are on ios click on uh, send and uh, after that uh, you can pick and choose anything from your files and uh, same goes for android but uh, here we have to uh make sure one thing that both phones are paired with each other so if you are on the uh, android then you can select one file let's talk about this file click on send and here we have uh, other bits and pieces grant location permission click open and allow this time open bluetooth and then click on next so you will see this notification if you are transferring from android to ios for the very first time camera permission needed to be given for scanning of barcode allow on this device and then you need to scan the barcode on your ios device if you don't want to do that you can basically go back and try to do that on your ios device click on send files photos or basically click on receive so here we have uh, this uh, question mark on the top right hand side if you click on that you will see this uh, instruction connect with ios and connect with android in order to connect with ios to ios uh, please make sure send and receiver are in the same wi-fi or hotspot area if you don't have wi-fi access you can uh, enable hotspot on one of the devices and connect the other one with that and that will work fine for sender click send for receiver click receive which is very straightforward and simple and then uh, uh, if you want to connect with android from iphone or if you have an I, uh, ios device and you want to connect with uh, the android device then for android phone users click receive on the share it button which we have uh, just pressed now click open and then you can see the rest of the instructions here and then click continue until the qr code appeared on your other device so as you can see we have a qr code on android device and on the ios device the app is open so what we're going to do is we are going to hit connect to android and then we are going to scan the barcode and follow the on screen instructions which will ask you to join the network and then from there on you can simply transfer files the file speed is quite amazing it's quite fast uh up to 100 mbps you can send in few minutes which is quite easy so both devices are now connected so now connected with each other so let's go back to the android uh, interface click on these four dots you will be taken back to the home screen here we have files videos apps shortcuts remember guys once you are inside the portal you don't have to connect uh, click on this cross button otherwise you will come back from the portal and here is the interface click on these four dots uh, circles then you will be taken back to the main screen files videos apps let's transfer a video file which is 3.41 seconds 3 minutes and 41 second click send and as you can see that the speed on screen is showing the amount of mbs uh, being transferred on a second uh, so it's like uh, 92.6 mbs of file size which has taken probably 7 to 10 seconds which is fair for a file size of this uh, uh, kind of video so here we have the file and then we can simply click on that hey and guys, play up? the file that will be basically saved into your device and uh, then you can share it 
and uh, use it whatever the way you want it. So this is the fastest way to transfer uh, files from uh, Android to iPhone or iPhone to Android. And if we click back, it will ask us to disconnect. So we will leave it as it is. We'll transfer another file. We'll go back on the same page. This time I'm trying to transfer a file which is 7.7 .7 minutes and 8 seconds. As you can see, this is one of my YouTube videos. So I'm trying to send that. And as you can see that we have 7 minutes uh, and 60 seconds video which is being transferred in 47 seconds altogether. 135 Mbps uh, uh, so far gone through. And uh, let's say talk about a minute of uh, transfer time which is obviously nothing if you compare that with uh, uh, anything else. Uh, let's say if you transfer files from an online server or using another app. So this is the fastest way guys I've discovered and uh, I've been using this every now and then in order to transfer my recorded videos. So here you can see that uh, 227 MBs are transferred. It's basically 187 MBs altogether and uh, we are sending these uh, three files. So 61 MB and 187 MBs and 92.7 MBs. So you can see that two files are already being transferred and third one is going through which is 187.9 MBs. So if you like this service, do let us know in the comment section below and I'll see you soon with another video. Till then take care. Bye-bye.